If you want to make a lot of money, there's no better place than Casablanca. Not too bad for a first attempt. Zoe! 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 Lucia's completely busted. Reza likes it dark in here. Reza likes it dark in here. Lucia's completely bu- Lucia- I never leave home without my mobile. Almost never. I'm sort of preoccupied at the moment. Knowing Reza, there's only beer and leftover pizza in the fridge. I've spent a lot of nights in that bed. It's very comfy and bouncy. I'm not particularly tired.
bathroom door. Um, no. Maybe I could get the spider in here. panel controls everything from the water temperature that panel controls everything from the water temperature to the audio system bathroom door panel controls everything from the water temperature to the audio system. I've removed Lucia's power source and brain. Nothing left but mechanical parts now. Nothing here. Reza wouldn't keep any of his work on this console. Knowing Reza, there's only beer and leftover pizza in the fridge. I'm not particularly tired. I've spent a lot of nights in that bed. It's very comfy and bouncy. I never leave home without my mobile. Almost never. Lucia's brain and power source, both completely busted. I don't think Reza's received any mail in the five years he's lived here.
traditional. I love this part of the city. It's so culturally diverse. Liv's workstation. No network in the world is safe when she gets... Liv? What's up, sweetie? Nothing much. I just stopped by to say hello. I'll see you later, OK? OK. Hey, Liv. I need some help. Sure. What? The spider fried Reza's Wattilla, and I need to get it running again to find his notebook. I've removed some parts from it, and I think they're broken. I'll take a look. Give me. Okay, so I can't fix either of these. They're totally fried. Do you have any replacement parts? I have a power source here somewhere. Hold on. That should work just fine, but I don't have a processing crystal in stock, I'm afraid. If you can't fix this one, then what about Lucia's memories? The data is continuously backed up to a separate crystal. You can use any Wattilla brain you want. How about the Wattillas you sell here? Don't they have brains? They're shells, refurbished. I'm waiting for an order from Watticorp, but it's not due until next week. I'm sorry. Okay, I have to figure it out myself. Thanks so much, Liv. Zoe. Central, screen off. Hello. Oh, hello. See you later. All right. Hey, Wonkers, I need you to switch yourself off for me. Why? Because... because I just need you to go to sleep for a bit. All right, Zoe. Promise to wake me up later? I promise. Nighty-night. Sorry. I'll put you back together once this is all over. I just need to twist the neck like... that. Ouch. That's it. The processing crystal. Poor old Wonkers is brainless. Literally. It's a Wattilla power thingy.
Dad doesn't like me going into his bedroom. And I can't say that I want to, either. Dad's bathroom. We Castillos like our privacy. a dream about you. I had many dreams. I dreamed that you took my mind away. You're okay now, Lucia. I am? Oh, that's good. Where's Reza? He'll be back soon, I'm sure. Good. I miss Reza. Lucia? Yeah, Zoe? Please, please let this work. I'll be here when you come back. Word, Zoe. I guess you received the message. Don't worry. Reza's probably okay, but he needs you to do him a favor. He keeps a notepad in his safe. It contains information about the stories he's currently working on. It's encrypted, but Olivia should be able to decrypt it. Ask her to hold on to it, and don't let it fall into the wrong hands. If something bad has happened to him, the reason why is most likely in that notepad somewhere. In that case, make sure the truth gets out. Follow me, Zoe. I'll open the safe for you. I see the notepad. Reza's notepad. Locked and encrypted, of course. Olivia will know how to open it. Hey! Hey, what are you doing here? Who are you? Don't! Reza likes it dark in here. Where's Reza? I miss Reza. I'm sure he'll be back soon. Good. I'll wait for him right here. 
Please switch yourself off, Lucia. Okay, Zoe. Do you think I'll dream about Reza? Maybe. Yes, I'm sure you will. Good. Sorry, Lucia. This belongs to Wonkers. Didn't I see that same cat yesterday? Hey Zoe, what's up? You look a little pale. You're not going to believe this. I was attacked. Again. What? Sweetie, are you okay? Yeah, just... just a bit shaken. Was it the eye? No. I was in Reza's apartment, looking for his notebook when these two girls showed up. They looked like they were twins. I really thought they were going to kill me. One of them slammed me up against the wall, knocked the breath out of me, and... Then they left. Both of them. Without saying a word. It looked like they received a message. What were they looking for? Did they take anything? No. They didn't even take the notebook. I dropped it on the floor. They must not have noticed it. I think I got really lucky. Then I came straight here. I need your help with the notes. And the notepad, do you still have it? Give it to me, sweetie, and I'll see what I can do. Hey, do you have the notebook? Give it to me and I'll take a look at it. Here's Reza's notepad. Okay, just a sec and I'll let you know what we're dealing with. Okay, sweetie. I need time to equip this thing. It's got some heavy locks on it. Except for the final entry. For some reason, that's only got basic encryption. Which Reza knows I'd be able to quickly crack. Of course! He wants us to read it. It says Venice Newport, The Fringe, Charlie. That's it. Newport. That's in North America, the West Coast. I wonder what The Fringe is. Maybe he's meeting this Charlie guy at a restaurant. I have to go to Newport. I don't know, sweetie. Maybe you should just give the information to Reza's editor. Let the hand that bites handle it. I can't do that. This is Reza we're talking about. He's in trouble. I can't just sit here and wait for him to come back. What if he needs my help? You're right. I mean, he's my friend too, and I want to help him. I just don't know if going to Newport is the way to do that. What else can I do? It's the only clue I have. Venice, Newport, the Fringe. That's probably where Reza's gone, to see this Charlie person. I'll work on decrypting the rest of Reza's notes. We need to figure out what he was working on. It could take a while, so I'll just close up the store. Are you sure? 
My regulars know how to get in touch. I'll call you as soon as I got something. Great. Thanks, Liv. You're the best. Take care, okay, sweetie? I want you back in one piece. I'll need to go home and get my backpack before I leave for Newport. Zoe. Hey, you're as good as new. How do you feel? I feel the same as always. Why? No reason. It's good to have you back. Thank you, Zoe. I smell the enemy. They are close. Okay, Naane, you divert their attention when they get close enough. Bryn, stay behind Chowan. I can handle- I don't care if you wield your sword like an Iguinon blade dancer. We're not at home, we don't have the advantage. Follow my lead, Bryn. Your blade will taste blood today. Worry not. Let the smoke clear before you attack. The toxins lose their effect quickly, but you should still not breathe them. Got it. Juan, what do they smell like, the enemy? Hush. Hold on. What is it? Frozen water. I haven't seen this before. You'll tire of it soon enough, Bayad. It's almost like, like walking on clouds. Would you believe that some Eastlanders strap metal bars to their feet to make them glide on the ice? It looks ridiculous. Shh. Did you hear something? Go back to the hell you came from. Shit! Yes! Westlander scum! Help me! Westlander scum! You got us now. Go back to the hell you came from, Azadi. The Azadi are coming farther and farther north. We kill ten, another twenty appear. So we kill them too. They're not invincible. That's not the way to stop them, Bryn. We need a better plan. 
Our sources in the city may have information. I hope so, but we need to focus on getting the supplies and bringing them back to the Swamplands. Everything else is secondary. They are all depending on us. If another moon passes, the children will be at risk. If they should fall ill... Na'ane is right. We go back as soon as we have what we came for. And we do not engage the enemy within scouting distance of the city. We'll be cautious, Juan. Now we continue, another few days due south, and we'll see her. Mercuria. I can't wait to see the city. If it's anything like you've described, April, it must be amazing. It's been a long time. Things change. Come on, let's move out. Lady, come, please. Nice and warm. I can feel my hands and toes again. You, come by. Best store in Venice. Cheap, top quality. Made in China. He looks like he could sell pretty much anything. And, okay, he does. Are you talking to me? Yes, yes, you. You see anybody else around? Didn't think so, no. Welcome to Best Shop in Venice. Anything you're looking for, I provide. Except drugs. Competition too strong. I don't want any drugs. Look, I'm new to this place, and I'm wondering if you... No shit. You fit right in. Now, what can I get you? I'm not looking to buy anything right now. Well, this is shop. Place of business. No loitering. I'm not loitering. You called me over here. <sighs> details, details. So, you need any help? I 
I'm looking for a place called the Fringe. Ah, the Fringe. So you know where it is? I certainly do. Well, could you tell me, please? <sighs> yes, yes. Keep pants on. Very close. Go to other side of Crossroads. Find Via Milano. Go through tunnel to Florence Square. And there you are. On the other side? Thanks. You are most welcome. And good luck. You buy something now? Best prices. Guaranteed. You, come by. Best store in Venice. Cheap. Top quality. Made in China. I'm guessing that's the front entrance to the Victory Hotel. Not very inviting, is it? It's locked. 